What's going on guys? This is me Mehdi Shakil and you are watching SS Tech Tutorial. So guys, in this video, I'm going to show you that how you can install and run Kali Linux operating system on your Windows 11 computer using the Hyper-V Manager. You don't need to install any third-party application to run virtual machine. Using the Hyper-V Manager, you can run Kali Linux operating system on your Windows 11 computer. And in this video, I'm going to show you how to do that. So further ado, let's get started. But before that, if you're new to this channel, then please do subscribe to this YouTube channel. And if you have already subscribed, then thank you so much. Okay, guys, now you can see my Windows 11 computer skin. Now, first of all, what you need to do, you have to enable the hypervisor and the virtual machine platform on your Windows 11 computer. Click on start and search for turn Windows feature on or off this option. Then click on it and open it. Then from here, make sure you have enabled the Hyper-V. Then you scroll down and select the virtual machine platform and windows hypervisor platform check mark all of this option then click on ok and after that your computer will restart and after the restart open up your browser then visit to kali.org this url this is the kali Linux official website now from here click on download then scroll down and click on virtual machine then again scroll down and after that download this hyper view option Click on this icon and it will start downloading this virtual machine on your Windows computer. Now, if I go to my downloads folder, here you can see I have Kylinux Hyper-V file. Now, first of all, we have to extract this file. So for this, I'm going to use the 7-zip to extract this file. Okay. Now here you can see we get a folder and into this folder, we have a file called Kali.vhdx. And also we get here a batch file and a partial file to install it directly from here. You can just double click on any of these two files and it will automatically install this Kylinux Hyper-V machine on your Windows Hyper-V. Now to install it, double click on this bat file and it's going to automatically install this Kylinux as a virtual machine into your hypervisor. Here you can see we have successfully imported it. Now press enter on your keyboard. Now click on start and search for Hyper-V. Then open it and now here you can see we have successfully imported the Kylinux Hyper-V here. Now to connect it, select it, then click on connect. Then click on start. And now here you can see we are running Kylinux virtual machine into this hypervisor on Windows 11. So by default, the username is Kali and the password also is Kali. Then click on OK. And guys, now here you can see we are running Kyle Linux as a virtual machine in Windows 11 computer using the Windows hypervisor. So guys, that's all for today. I hope you like this video. If you really like this video and enjoy this video, then please give it a big thumbs up and share this video with your friends. And guys, if you're new to this channel, then please do subscribe to this YouTube channel and don't forget to press the bell icon to get all the latest upcoming video tutorial notification. I'm Mehdi Shakil, you're watching this tech tutorial and I'm signing out.